What's going on, guys? This is Mark back here, episode four of our journeyman career mode. I'm not wearing a twirl the jersey because a it's hard as fuck to find one unless you guys tell a good place to get one. Anywho, <laughs> um, we are back for episode four of our journeyman career mode, and I'm leaving you on this. Um, yeah, Jura Barrett's Odessa president looking to step aside. Um, it looks like it looking to sell the club, which basically means we probably can't do anything, right? No, we still can. Okay, we're gonna ask for an affiliate and that kind of affiliate. Okay, I was not expecting that. Okay, so it looks like we may be in the process of uh, rumors of a potential board takeover. Okay, there's, there we go. So last time we left off, uh, we left off at the win. As you can tell, things haven't gone our way. The 4 nothing against Shakhtar, it's Shakhtar. They're expected to win the league. Nothing really much we can do there. Lviv, they're... What the hell are they? They are sixth in the... I'm just going to call it the Premier League. The Ukrainian Premier League. That, I mean, they had a guy sent off in the 8th minute and we couldn't capitalize. The game against Diddy Pro 1... That we left it late because they scored in the 90th minute and I thought we were going to be able to actually get a point from D Pro who's also in the top 10. But then the game I just played a few minutes ago, uh, off camera obviously, um, was the uh, Volan Lutsk. I mean, really nothing happened in that game. You see the match stats, we were completely in control. We just couldn't get anything. So, I let... Since we, I last, since I last left you guys, if I can actually, you know, speak properly, we know this is not a proper thing for me to do. Don't mind me. My phone is going crazy right now. Um, we last left off on the 31st of July. The transfer deadline just closed four days ago. As you see, um, they're getting an under 19s coach. This guy rejected us, even though he looks absolutely amazing for us. But as you see, we did a lot and only sold Pospilov so he doesn't stare into our faces ever again. So up to the 31st. Okay, so basically we brought in these guys. We brought in seven people. Uh, some of them were like, uh, like the under 21s or under 18s, whatever. So we'll go uh, one by one. We are going first uh, Thibaut Kil... Sillard. He's worth about 600k. We got him for free. As you see, he's actually pretty good. He's a leading player for the second division, which means he's probably not the greatest here, but in one game, he's got a 6.3, so I can't really complain. Uh, up next, Osman Juf, the 21-year-old Gambian. International, by the way. He's also one of the leading uh, second division Four games, obviously you see we haven't scored, but he's got a 6.5, which for us isn't that half bad. Up next is a guy that the under, is that our general manager or head of youth development signed? Awesome, congratulations. Uh, that's him again. Um, they signed another one, Bohan. Doesn't look like he'll turn out to be anything, but I figured if you want to sign anybody, go for it. Up next, we have Kurikov, another one they've just randomly signed. Doesn't look potential at all. Again, Havlo, they've done nothing at all. So, we've brought in Zhao Victor from Gremio, Os Gremio Osasco in South America, or Brazil. I don't know where, I don't know what division. Uh, don't ask, but Zhao Victor. 22-year-old Brazilian. He looks absolutely amazing. He's per he's currently a decent player for most top or er, Premier League sides. In one game, he's got a 7.3, so I love him already. So, uh, and we, as you see, we still have a few games to go until the Zorha game, so I'll leave it right there, and we'll be back for the game. Bad news, they didn't want to get an affiliate or a senior... Uh, affiliate club or a senior affiliate even though it could garner extra income and everything else like that even though our bank balance is actually halfway decent yay all right we are back on match day and as you see i found this guy 
because he came through on like the scouting thing. He's not actually half bad. We had him on trial. He looks better than Juf. Uh, if we just compare the two, uh, Usman Juf. Usman Juice is better defending, but they're equal on physical speed. He's better on vision. Oleg is better on vision. He counts as homegrown, too. Or, yeah, homegrown. He's better there, so I'm gonna have... I'm gonna play him. I'm gonna sign him first. Figure he's already Ukrainian, so he already knows the language. All we have to do is just ask him to do the handshake and say, Hey, help. The squad now has an abundance of game-changing forwards. That's what I like to see. I don't think he'll be ready for... Uh, the game? Of course, he's unregistered. I totally forgot to do that. Oleg, and you count towards that. Eh... Uh, yeah, let's go team selection. Oleg, you're here. Yay. Um, let's take out Slinkin, but add Slinkin in over here. Um, hmm. Siskov. Huh. Uh, I'm going to have you inverted winger on support. A Jao Victor versus Oleg. Well, uh, God, Oleg Sinstia. They're about the same, and he's a good backup, so I'll take him. Um, yeah. Radkov and Trimia? Because am I right? But right only? Okay, that works. Um, all right. Uh, opposition instructions. Let's just put a tight marking on him and him. Most red cards is their attacking left. Um, uh, right foot, left foot, that's just dominant legs. Um, either foot doesn't really matter. Lazar, oh my god, that's where he fell. Obviously, if you can see the banners behind me, I'm a big Liverpool fan, so... Yeah. Wow, okay. Uh, if he... His preferred foot is the right foot, so go weaker foot. That should be fine. Um, we're following the box. There we go. Um, yeah, let's have a lower tempo, shorter passing. Do nothing crazy with it. Um, just distribute it, play it out the back like we always do. Standard, do a lower line, force him inside, and I think that should be good. So, here, uh, okay, there we go. Uh, backup goalie that I'm never gonna use. 68, just to cuck ya. And Oleg, let's go with the number. Hmm, not 14, 14 is an important number. 24, there we go. People are concerned with the tactical familiarity. I mean, we are training this, so. And then Shevchenko, oh god. Um, we've got nothing to lose here. Yeah, we got nothing to lose here, but I got faith in you. Come on, boys, let's make this interesting. Brekov wins it, okay, up to Duarte. Oh my god, this really is a very slow tempo. Mar over to Slinkin. Slinkin wins it away from Markovic. Siskov and the Juve. Ooh, good place. Oh, I would have said good place, Slinkin, but went right back to him. Lovely. Ooh, Markovic, I think we gotta mark a little bit tighter because it looks like he's doing the inside. Um, keep an eye on him. Oh, goody. Free kick. 
Over to bar, thank God. Um, hey, we have a shot, yay. Um, they're playing the exact same formation as us, which fucking sucks, but... Uh, let's encourage the boys a little. We're in our home stadium. It looks beautiful, even though we barely have any fans in here. Another highlight for them, question mark? Brekov wins it to absolutely nobody. Lovely. Oh, thank God. I thought it was a penalty. Thank God. Also, our starting goalie is literally out. I forgot to show you guys. Yeah, our starting goalie is actually out with an injury. That's why we have to play Roman Yoli at uh, goalkeeper. Brekov yeets it up to Silva, but kind of messes it up. I gotta admit, for being 130k, oh my god, our defense is absolutely terrible. Wow! Brett Cobb. Brett Cobb, what the hell? Ooh. Uh, yes, please change it. Because it looks like Brett Cobb cannot do anything with it. Granted, there's... They, uh, they would move up to third if results hold. We are down in 14th. I mean, we at least have points over them and i don't think we played all Andrea yet so after the first yeah F, yeah they've been in dominant control um let's just go hands in the hips um show them what it is on the second uh, i'm not happy with defensive i'm not happy i'm not happy i'm not happy hey people are inspired switch it up to balance encourage them a little okay brad cobb isn't doing that well Wow, um... Oh, up to Lucas Rodriguez. Lucas Silva, Joe Victor, Joe Victor, Joe Victor! First goal! There we go, boys! I knew it was a good signing for him. First ever goal for Torno Moretz. Let's go! The two Brazilians hooking up, Lucas Silva, a.k.a. Lucas Rodriguez, and Jal Victor gets it blocked once, gets right back to him, by the way. That was beautiful. Uh, I'm going to praise you because that looked nice. Zubieko and the Juf. That the Juf. Siskov. Oh, my God. Um, I think we just have her go with a season contender already. Oh my god. Boom. Oh my god. That was gorgeous. Siskov, I'm going to praise you as well because that, oh my god, that was beautiful, Lucas. Okay, okay. More it up to Silva and Lucas. Yes, boys, let's go. Everybody's getting their first goals. Lucas Rodriguez, excellent goal. His first ever one for us. Let's go, boys. Unfortunately, to be become homegrown, it's five years, so it's a shame we didn't get him when they were like 15 or 16, but you know. I'll take it, especially if he's gonna score goals like that. Absolutely. Now, if we can hold goals like this, that would be amazing. Mara, Duarte, good. Good save, Romagnoli. Good save. Good save. Bad distribution, though. Gives it literally right back to him. Oh, what a save, Romagnoli. Hello. All right, 77 minutes gone. Okay, that's better distribution. That is not great dribbling. Seeking, good save, Romagnoli. 
All right, so I figured for the last 10 minutes, we're going to change up formation. We're going to make Siskov. Hello, can I make him another defender? Thank you very much. Um, hmm. Let's make him a libero. I don't ever recommend doing that, but let's do it either way. All right, so uh, let's make deep line playmaker. There we go. Duarte can just stay right there. Uh, Juve, you, you can come off for Atri. Hello, Oleg can play there. Oleg, you're getting a debut. And Mar is injured. Lovely. Um, hmm. Oleg cannot play the left? Question mark. He could probably play the left. So you're playing there. Um. Uh, Kozak, you're in. All right, boys, seven minutes left. Let's hold the lead. Let's give him some little praise. Oh, God. Apparently, our goalie's playing out of his mind. Roman, you always got a 7.7 .7 as a goalie, Lucas. Lucas. All right, all right, all right. All right, so, uh, frequently waste time. Long kick it up to the flanks. That's fine. Um, hmm. Joe Victor, I think I'm, hmm. Let's see, 90 minutes. Uh, yeah, we could bring, pardon me, you off. Um, actually, yeah. We'll bring him off, but we'll move Oleg over there and then bring in Arthur. Let's go with that. <laughs> Waste of time, get the points, get the three points. Let's go, boys. Second, third game on camera, second win. I'll take it. Wow. Um, you done brilliantly to come back. I'm proud of you guys. Um, I'm extremely impressed with who, where is he? Joe Victor. Your performance was spectacular. Uh, you were a decisive factor, and who else scored? Siska! That was a beautiful, and I'm very happy. Let's go, boys! Romagnoli makes a debut. He didn't play that bad. I'm really impressed. Mara is injured out three to four weeks. That kind of sucks. Romagnoli, I'm going to praise your last game because you played out of your fucking mind. Uh, Post-match, I'm not going to do. But basically, our quote-unquote starting goaltender, uh, he's only going to be out another couple days, but I'm going to start Romagnoli in the next game against uh, Poltov. So I'll see you for that game, unless anything happens. All right, so pretty much no changes from last team, from last side, except for Jao Victor's get Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to stick with Jao Victor on the, on the right and go with Oleg on the left. Keeping Lucas up top. And Juve, I'm... Mm. I'm not entirely a fan of Juve here, so we're going to go with Valive. And then we're staking Slinkin, Prima, Brat Cubs, blah, 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 And, uh, uh, yeah, there we go. Um, looks like he's just a normal winger. Looks like an inverted winger, so we'll do that. Wrong Octavio that I'm aware of. <laughs> um... Go with that, and then basically captains, we had that set up, and then, oh my god, so that doesn't annoy me. Yay! Let's go to the match! Uh, Ibrahim Kane, yeah, no one I've ever heard of. With the underdogs, boys, I got faith in yous. Let's go, boys! Roman Yoli still starts in net, even though we have the uh, Pivodic uh, uh, back on uh, good. Back from injury. There we go. There's the word I'm looking for. Oh, Slinkin. Oh, Romagnoli.
Roman Yoli, I feel so bad for you. Oh my lord. I feel so bad. Right through his legs. Oh. Oh, I feel so bad. There we go. Uh, Kane up to Octavio. Bracca, very good. I. Why are we not trying to intercept the balls or anything like that? You know, or. Yikes. This is not gonna go well, I can already tell. Wow, yeah, this is not going to go well. Um, hmm. Uh, give it a little bit more fucking pressing, please, thank you. I probably will take Duarte off because it looks like he is extremely struggling. Um, which sucks. Alright, Duarte, you're coming off. Um, I'm not risking anything. Ah, uh, let's go with... Uh, do I want to go with Poultra or Koze? Let's go with Putra for now. Although it looks like... Although, correct me if I'm wrong, why do I have a number 9 as a bots to bots midfielder? Well, I was not expecting that. <laughs> All right, come on, boys. Encourage him a little bit more. Praemia, you still are using off tackles. Why are you doing that? Putria, nope. Wow, yeah, this is... Oh. Okay, I'm... Ay, ay, ay. Uh, I have literally Lucas, Oleg, and V and Valive have not done anything. Um, actually, you know what? No, Trechikov can go here. Oh god. Um, Jao Victor hasn't done that bad. Oleg's been terrible. Uh, let's get Juve on. Wow. Um, not good, boys. Uh, let's just try and run at the defense, maybe. Yeah, there... There's no way we're winning this, so... I will concede now! I am conceding now. You are going back to your libero role, thank you. Trechikov, I'm just gonna keep you there. Putria, deep line playmaker, I'll just put you on defend. Uh, I'll just put you as Mazala right there. Yeah, this didn't go well. This went about as well as I thought it might have. Um, oh, God. Cisco, good header. Kane, Premia. It's a good header, but we have nobody, like... Oh, I don't know. Counter-attacking it? Oh, Zubiaco! Alrighty, this is why I'm trying to find a right back. It's gonna be a penalty. Penalty awarded, as we all thought. Alright, Octavio, come on, Rowan Yoli, you played halfway decent in the first. Three, two, one. He did it the right way, he just didn't dive enough. I mean, we're getting outshot 24 to 4, so... 
Wow. It is just one of those days, boys. Um, yeah, that's... Depressing, actually. Powerless to resist as Paul Tava, who I think were... Prediction fifth, yeah. I knew they were halfway decent. Um, yeah. So with that, I think we're going to end the episode. That's where we leave off. Um, wow. Uh, we have Mariupol, Olympic Donetsk, Dynamo Kiev, which... Rush Liev, uh, probably a cup game. Um, actually, yeah, I'll play these. I'll play these four off camera. One, two, three, four, and then we'll come back for the cup game, and we'll come back for the, sorry, the cup game and the Alexandria game. Um, in the meantime, if you guys enjoyed this, don't mind me as I hit the wrong scene on OBS. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this. Hit the like button, subscribe for new, and. Do you want to see me do like a Twitch save of this or not of this specifically, but do you want to see a Twitch save of Football Manager or a YouTube stream of this? Let me know down in the comments below and hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching.